Understanding, I'll take a sip, a guide for English learners. Hello, everyone. Today, we're going to explore a common English phrase, I'll take a sip. Understanding everyday phrases like this is key to mastering conversational English. So, let's dive in and learn all about this phrase, its usage, and its nuances. I'll take a sip is a phrase used when someone intends to drink a small amount of a liquid, usually in a casual or social setting. The word sip implies drinking slowly or taking a small quantity. It's often used in situations where you want to taste a drink or when you're drinking something slowly to enjoy it. This phrase is versatile and can be used in various scenarios. For instance, 1. Tasting a new drink. When someone offers you a new beverage, saying, I'll take a sip, indicates your willingness to try it. 2. Social gatherings. In social situations, like a party or a meeting, this phrase can be used to join in the drinking casually. 3. Expressing moderation. When you want to drink something, but only a little, this phrase shows your intention to consume in moderation. English is a flexible language, and this phrase can be modified slightly to fit different contexts. Can I take a sip? This is a polite way to ask for permission to try someone else's drink. I'll just have a sip. This variation emphasizes that you will only drink a very small amount. Let me take a sip. Used when you're more assertive or eager to try something. Pronunciation is key to sounding natural. Here are some tips. Sip. The S should be soft, like in C. The IP is short and crisp. Al, it's a contraction of I will. The I is pronounced like the letter I and LL. Sounds like LL in will. And that's all about the phrase, I'll take a sip. Remember, practicing these phrases in real life situations is the best way to learn. I hope this video helps you feel more confident in your English speaking skills. Until next time, keep learning and cheers to your progress.